Ten earlier against Haruhazu. And I believe he might be projected. Was was he projected to win this? Uh, it doesn't seed round robin. Oh, it doesn't seed round robin. No, because everyone fights anyone. Or, everyone fights everyone anyway. So no. seed doesn't matter. That makes sense. I no bias or anything, but I still see him winning this. I could see him doing it. Honestly, Zanoli has had a lot of progress. Um, He's been improving so much. It's, yeah, it's kind of scary. He consistently beats me now. Um, he, and then E.T., I know, obviously had a really good Tuesday. Yeah. So this was, I don't think they fought, though. Yeah, they may not. I don't believe they fought. Yeah, the other thing, too, believe. that's kind of factoring into this, uh, E.T. is not playing on her usual controller scheme. She is not. She unfortunately lost her controller um, or misplaced it. Um, so hopefully that doesn't affect her play here too much because this should be a good matchup. We don't know because she hasn't she hasn't played on stream yet, if I'm correct. Right, both these guys hadn't been on stream, so that's why yeah. I put them on here. Nice grab there by Zanillite. Causing the phase shift because he had a bit too many phase, phase shift points. I love that dragon. Ooh, yes. I thought that worked for Blastoise, but I'm like, oh, she's in the air. It's not going to matter. Yeah, E.T.'s getting caught up a lot by the anti-projectile. Yeah, anti-projectile is not did, fun to deal with. Why did she do a 2x there? May have been a misinput. Misinput, likely. That's the most likely explanation for that. Yeah. Ah, so round two. Um, round one going to Zenit right there. Using, yep, using shell stance for uh, approaching. That's what I like about Blastoise. Mm -hmm. He has such good movement in his, in Ooh, his shell. Yeah. Zenoid is very, very good at catching jumps um, and calling those out. Yep. He's really good at setting up and... His main thing is catching grabs and setting up. Mm -hmm. If you uh, can get past... Yeah, that goes... Yeah, it's all projectiles. If you can get past all that and just kind of, like, make him guess, he doesn't... It kind of falls flat for him. But it, it's not like it doesn't work for him. Yeah. They both act yep. Yeah, these uh, are just going to cancel each other yep. out. He can act right out of that, too. He acts out, he can act out faster than most other characters. <laughs> nice, yep. That rabbit spin is like a huge, like, knowledge check. Yep, exactly. And especially as someone who has a fair amount of projectiles for their usual game plan, it's throwing E.T. off. We can definitely tell that. So she, she, need, she needs to alter her gameplay um, and the game plan for the match to avoid projectiles. Otherwise, yeah. we're just going to fall into the same results on this game, too. And you can't 100% blame her for all of that because it throws off even top players, too. Well, yeah. Like, like, it, like Rabbit Spin throws off everyone. <laughs> it's, it's the same thing for Blaziken versus, like, say, Sceptile. We usually have an aerial approach, but Sceptile has such great anti-air options that we have to change our game plan. Yeah. So there are just matchups like that. You can't play with one exact style for every single matchup. Yep. But that, and, but the problem is, is when you're when you're just starting to get good, you kind of tend to you kind of tend to like revert to one strategy because you know it's gonna it's gonna get you far. Yeah, absolutely. So you got to start like adapting other strategies or like changing them. Nice counter off of that two XX. Ah. Yep, you got to be watching that. Um, you got to be watching that um, distance between you and Blastoise. Mm -hmm. There's that certain amount of distance where he can get you with literally anything he wants. Whether it be water spout, bubble, I on get up or um, water spout. I think maybe one of the suggestions I would have... Ooh, nice. Nice grab. Um, one of the suggestions I would have in field phase, at least, for Decidueye is uh, go for a bit more of the aerial options. Try to go for the slam. Try yeah. to go uh, for stuff like that because you're going to be able to punish Rapid Spin on the, the whiff. Uh, it gets you in the air, so ideally if you do it fast enough, you're out of the way. He doesn't have a lot of stuff that goes up anyway. Yeah. He and just kind of has, like, JY and back Y. That's really it. Nice, nice approach there by, Fal by E.T. That's what you need to do. You really you need to be patient and know exactly when to approach. Mm -hmm. Really good combo there for me. Nice release Y. The leafage. That would have taken out the Magnemite, if I'm, if I'm correct in saying correct. Uh, I believe so, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Barely. I think if she was just a little bit closer, that would have caught before it Yeah, before it better if she did that for it. Yeah. Uh, nice. Nice. Yeah. nice watching there. Yeah. One thing you never do against someone who's in burst is counter. Counter in front you, of... You countering... Just, you, you hit that X and A and you sealed your fate. Countering <laughs> that's not um, meaty or as an Oki setup. Mm -hmm. Nice. Really good whiff punch option there. Like, the projectiles can definitely work. It's just you have to bait out the rapids. You have to know.
Yep, nice. Okay. <sighs> Just... He's, he's going to be looking for those grabs when you block, so you, you're going to have to watch out for that option. Yep. Okay. Okay. Nice counter there by Zanella. Yeah. Ooh, able to get around. Nice. Uh, Chuck behind. Maybe wall splat? Nope. nope. Okay. But in the corner. Oh, no. A little, a little off on that. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> nice rabbit spin there. This is round two. Of game I two. love these JY jump ins. Yep. Those are fantastic. They're really good. She's really good at just approaching with JY. It's great. Yeah. Yeah, Charges that, up that the homing. The Zanillite was a little upset that he can't really do much off of his counter. Uh, I don't know. She better remember to block. Okay. She, she didn't block the first two hits, but like she was able to block it in time. Nice burst. Call out there from Zanillite. Uh, careful. Yeah. Yeah. They're trying to respect first, and it becomes a stalemate. Oh, <laughs> barely oh, misspaced geez. that grab. I mean, she's no, gonna she's go fine. over that. Yep. The punish. Oh, that works. That works. Charge okay. that anti air up a little too much. If he would have done, if he would have just, oh, night. That was a good JX there. If he would have charged was. that, a, if he would have let go of that button a little sooner, it would have, it would have just gotten her. Mm -hmm. But he charged it a little too far, and she just kind of hit him out of it. Yep. Alright, Zanillite taking another set 